Let's take a look at the wide receivers real quick. Justin Jefferson won, of course. Tyreek Hill, Devontae Adams, Diggs, Cooper Cup, Chase Hopkins. Yeah, you know something, dude? I'm good with everybody on this list. I am. If it was my preference, I would change around a couple of things. I still think Devontae Adams is the best receiver in football. I would put him number one. Right. I would have Jefferson number two. Tyreek Hill would be my three, and then so forth. Mm-hmm. Cup digs. I really like Cooper Cup, man. I think he's severely underrated, but I think they got pretty much all the top guys here. Like, just overall looking at it. DeAndre Hopkins, though. It, yeah, of course, mm, bro. Look, don't, let, let's not get out here and disrespect Nook Hopkins, bro. We know what he can do, bro. And the fact that they I know, they know but, it too. He missed mm, most of the year, but ninety-three still. Mm, I don't know, bro. Yes, yes. Mm-hmm. This is Hopkins, would, bro. Mm, I don't know. Jamar Chase. I feel like should be at least top five. I feel like he should be top five. I I feel like he should have Stephon Diggs, but. Because Jamar Chase, man, for real, is a real animal. I like yeah, Jamar Chase. So I would put Jamar Chase at that four. I would have Stefan Diggs at five. And I would have Cooper Cup at six. Yeah, I would put Cooper Cup and Jamar Chase ahead of Diggs, too. Mm-hmm. But like I said, barring a few adjustments that I would do, I, I like all the guys on here. I think they got the right guys on the list. Like I would put A.J. Brown over Terry McLaurin, mm-hmm. me personally. What so. about what about CD Lamb? CD Lamb ain't, ain't ain't doing nothing. I think I think CD Lamb's a great receiver, but what, is there a receiver that you see right here that you'd rather take CD Lamb instead of that receiver? That's the problem. Maybe a Mari, maybe a Mari Cooper, maybe, maybe a Mari Cooper. I mean, maybe at this point, yeah. That, but that's that last spot, though. You know what I'm saying? That's right where I mean. Right. So if you threw him out, put him up there. That might be all right too. I mean, yeah. it's. He is a great CD, receiver, CD, bro. CD Lamb, just, man, be ju- man be juking them boys out. They socks, bro. I love no to question. see him play. Amari no. Cooper, he over there with freaking the Browns now, man. And I don't think he's been doing really that big work or whatever, especially with the transition of the quarterbacks and stuff as well. So I don't know how his stuff gets so high, you know. So, but like I said, that, 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 I still feel like it's fair though. He, he's still a top guy, you know. I don't know if he's top ten, but you know. It is what it is. No doubt. There's just a lot of good receivers, man. And I can't say I would definitively take CeeDee Lamb over any of these guys on this list that I'm looking at. Mm-hmm. I think they got it right, though. I'm McLaurin, good with the receivers. Man, McLaurin, man, is really, man, really going to take over this year, though. Even though he ain't got Heineke, Heineke, <laughs> Heineke. He ain't got Heineke over there, man. That man went to uh, Atlanta. But, man, y'all got to figure out who y'all going to have over there, man, really, really throwing that thing out there. Who, who is they starting quarterback now? Ritter, Desmond Ritter. For Atlanta, or Washington. Oh, Washington. Uh, Sam Howell. He might have. Some, he might have a little luck over there. Then, okay. Yeah, y'all keep know. doing y'all thing. though, definitely. I ain't, I ain't too mad with this list, man. Just the order. 